Hey guys, what's up? It's been a little while, well, probably been a day since my last video upload. And just a little update before I open these packs. <coughs> I'm a little sick, as you can tell. I probably sound sick too. But uh, just an update for Wednesday and Thursday, what happened with my videos. My Siege video that only came out at 4 o'clock, I was supposed to have one at 9 and 4 like always. But I had an upload fail, I don't know why it did. The other one uploaded just fine, but the earlier one didn't. So I uploaded it at noon, because I knew I was sick. I wasn't playing games the last couple days. It was my first time with my with myself sitting in my chair at my desk making videos again. So now that's out of the way. Let's get these packs. Videos will be slow again while I'm still recovering. Because I don't want to play a million games, keep coughing and sniffing in my videos. I'll, I'll feel bad making that as videos all the time. But, um... Brandon Marshall, you know, at least it's something. <coughs> I'm really sorry for coughing. But, uh, I most want to do this because uh, Ultimate Legends are out now. 99, uh, Mike Vic. You know, that's, that's a nice TJ Wood I pulled. But anyways, 99 Vic and 98 Jason Taylor as uh, the Ultimate Legends to start. Pretty excited. I'm not a running guy, so I wouldn't really be too thrilled if I got Vic. Yeah, it'd be cool. I'd probably instantly sell him to someone. You know, I'd try to sell... Ooh, an Elite Badge. But it's not like, uh... I want One, I'm not good with left-handed quarterbacks in Madden. And two, if I have a running quarterback, I'll keep trying to run. Which would be a huge mistake. Uh, I'll just keep fumbling and fucking everything up. Now, I'll run and throw the ball, which I'll throw more interceptions that way. So I'd just rather stick to what I usually use. Ah, oh, no Elites that time. Damn. But, um, but anyways. So, I'm really hoping I can get at least something for the Ultimate Legends. Some of the toppers for this, these Game Changer packs were guaranteed, uh, ooh. Um, let me see. One of my other corners out there. I know who they are, but. Alright, so he'll be going in for what Desmond is. Wow. He's actually pretty good. I'll probably throw, uh, Roby right in after the video. And, uh, yeah, like I said, getting the Super Bowl Legends is the toppers for the, uh, two 8,000 point packs. Pretty interesting. I'm actually really excited to see what I can get. I hope I get, uh, Ty Law. I still didn't finish the set yet. I was getting close. I need the elite Super Bowl players, which are fucking expensive. I think I need ten more of them. Oh, thanks. 500 free coins. Gold badge, no elites. Damn. But, uh... Alright, let's keep this going. Let's try to get, uh... Get something. Philly Brown. Come on. Come on. No, elites. Come on, man. Come on, give this sick kid something. Give me something to look forward to. The next time I play Madden, I have something to look forward to. Come on. Where's the red? Is it right there? Nope, it's not. Tell me, kill you, big mofo. Damn. Holy shit. Oh, I got Roby again. Oh, Philly Brown. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that card even existed. Since I got an extra one, time to do in the old Super Bowl 50 set. I don't think he makes my roster at all, but I'm going to see if he does. Because if he does, uh, that would be a nice little addition to Elites in that one, which is nice. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Can't control those coughs. Uh, oh, come on. Yuck. Might as well to pull the bronze quarterback. Ah. <sighs> Come on now. Give me something good. Really? You just give me three giants in a row? Right. Now, Elite. Uh, nope. Good tight end, though. Too bad uh, I didn't just start playing Ultimate Team. I would have been really excited about that. Man, if people would just start playing Ultimate Team now and bought this, like these bundles right here, you would have, had a pr you'd have a pretty solid team. Good. Almost every card's gold. And you almost get an elite in every single pack. 
And you get a lot of badges. Look at that. Holy shit. I love my Brady, but I might have to throw him in for a little bit. 91 overall punter. Didn't even know there was a above 90 overall punter yet. I knew there was the kicker. Oh, I didn't know that Scott Chandler even existed. See what I miss out? I never pulled that card at all. I don't remember ever pulling that Scott Chandler. <clears throat> Vic Beasley. Come on. Give me something. Give me like an Ultimate Legend fucking collectible. Or an Ultimate Legend badge. I know that's a thing now. I can't remember if those were in Madden last year. Ultimate Legend badges. I honestly forget how uh, Ultimate Legends worked last year. I don't know why. I completely forgot. I love them. <clears throat> and I forget. Wasn't Ultimate Legends last year. Wasn't it something for their stats you'd pull? Wasn't that what it was? You pulled like their... I mean not their uh, stats. Like... So you'd pull a speed for Michael Vick, then you get the throwing power and the throw accuracy. Oh, look at look at Bennett. That's nice. But um, I think that's how it worked last year, isn't it? And then maybe legend badges with it. I can't. I don't see. Oh, holy shit! Didn't know that was a card either. I'm pulling cards I didn't know existed. Man, Ultimate Team's Twitter is slacking. Cause I didn't know these things existed yet. Oh, it's probably because I was sick and I haven't checked Twitter, so I probably just didn't see anything. Like, I didn't know Ultimate Legends came out until, uh, my boy Flynn texted me yesterday. He asked me, are Ultimate Legends out? Yes, and I don't know. <laughs> I'm sick, I haven't played. He goes, ah, I think so. I said, did they tweet it? He said, yes. Yeah. So, checked their Twitter, and I saw Mike Vick and Jason Taylor. It's kind of nice they cut down on 99 overalls. But at the same time, it's like, they're Ultimate Legends. I'd like to see them at 99 overalls. Across the board would be nice. Alright, well, Super Bowl topper, I got four items in this one. One of my four items. Yeah, alright, so just the games. No players, I guess. Actually, it says items, so yeah. Alright, Super Bowl legend topper number one. Come on. Ooh, that's nice. Uh oh, it froze. Uh oh. Oh no! What did I pull? I know all I know is I got Akeem Hicks and it froze. What what if it was Ty Law? I know it was a sign. I got locked down. Oh no. Mid video game freezing crash. What the fuck? Come on, I'm sick, man. Struggling to talk and breathe. The overall legend somehow is gonna make a 60 overall like backup quarterback. Oh, come on. I hope it was Ty Law and that was like a sign from EA God saying you just got locked down by Ty Law and that's why it kicked me off Madden. So I all I know is I got Akeem Hicks. That's awesome to my receiving core so far. That's all I know I got. I hope to God I got Ty Law. He's getting Ty Law and even adding Roby to my corner system. My top four corners will be nice to work with. <coughs> oh my god. Oh, I know I'm nervous. Please don't please don't be a quarterback of any I don't want a quarterback. I take anything but a quarterback. Mostly because I don't I won't take another quarterback till I get another Tom Brady, that's it. I don't have enough coins to get 96 Brady, so that's not happening anytime soon. Oh my god, I voice crack with my damn illness still. I was hoping I wouldn't voice crack as much, because my voice hasn't been able to go high pitch lately. Please. Watch, I have to open them all again. Do I have any packs left to open? No, none left. Alright, so the card was opened. The pack was opened. Let's go newest. Who would I get? Oh, Vernon Davis. Still not bad. That's not bad at all. Time to promote this mofo to starter. I can't promote Akeem Hicks to start because my Isaac Bruce is better. 
Oh my god. I'm dying out here, guys. I'm dying. And Akeem Hicks helps, though. Gives me more weapons. Because I like throwing the ball. That's probably bad. No, I like to throw the ball because that's why I throw a lot of interceptions. You know what? I don't give a fuck. It's worth it. Especially when you got good receivers to throw to. It helps a lot. <laughs> it helps my confidence to throw it. Oh yeah, so I forgot to tell you guys, I pulled, I always open one pack, so you guys know, before I start my pack opening, I open one pack just so I get an idea what the packs are like, so when the packs are open and I can say this is what's in the packs, I pulled Ely in one of my, in that one pack I opened before uh, the whole thing, before I re started recording, which was honestly a really nice pull to get. <coughs> so my cores are just thickening up a bit, which is nice. Let's see, which one would I prefer? I guess Chris Harris, he's got better stats across the board. Compared to him. Alright, so my corner's improved. Oh yeah, I did... I don't think uh, I put this in a video yet. I now have Cam Chancellor as my strong safety. Only because he's taller than Chung. And I didn't like having a short guy. I love Chung, but I didn't want the short guy back there the whole time. I'm just going to compare Breach at 91 punter. I want to see what stats they got. So only difference really is the fact that Brady can throw. Kick accuracy isn't the big deal, it's the power. I might keep I'm gonna keep Brady. He won't start. I'll keep that punter in instead. Alright, well that's not bad. Got some nice additions to the squad now. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hope to be better soon to make more videos for you guys. And I'll see you all later.